Most people think testosterone is all about genetics, steroids, or some magic supplement. But the truth is, your diet plays a massive role in how much testosterone your body produces and maintains. Today I'm going to go over the foods that are backed by science to increase testosterone levels, not bro science, and explain how they work. So without further ado, let's get into the video. First up is pomegranate. Pomegranate has to be one of the most underrated foods when it comes to overall hormonal health. Human studies have shown that drinking pomegranate juice daily can significantly increase salivary testosterone levels in both men and women, in some cases by over 20%. The main reason is it's extremely high in polyphenols called elagitanins, which reduce oxidative stress and improve overall blood flow. And less oxidative stress means that your latex cells, the cells that produce testosterone, function a lot better. On top of that, pomegranate improves nitric oxide signaling, which enhances circulation and overall endocrine function. Next is eggs, specifically whole eggs. Eggs contain cholesterol, which is the raw material that your body uses to synthesize steroid hormones, such as testosterone. Eggs are also rich in vitamin D, which is strongly correlated with higher testosterone levels in men. Several studies show that men with sufficient vitamin D levels tend to have higher total and free testosterone levels compared to men who are deficient. Eggs are truly one of the most efficient hormone supporting foods that you can eat. Another big one is fatty fish, like salmon, mackerel and sardines. They're high in omega-3 fatty acids, which reduce inflammation and improve testicular function. Chronic inflammation is one of the fastest ways to suppress your testosterone levels. Fatty fish also provide vitamin D, selenium and high quality protein, all of which support androgen production. There's also evidence that omega-3s improve latex cell sensitivity, meaning your body responds better to luteinizing hormone the hormone which signals your body to produce more testosterone. Now let's talk about red meat, but with some nuance. Red meat provides zinc, iron, and B vitamins, especially B12, which are all essential for testosterone production. Zinc deficiency alone is known to drastically reduce testosterone levels. However, this doesn't mean that eating excessive amounts of fatty processed red meat is ideal. Lean, high-quality cuts of grass-fed red meat tend to be the sweet spot. Zinc is particularly important because it inhibits aromatase, the enzyme that converts testosterone into estrogen, which you don't want. Another highly underrated food for increasing testosterone is shellfish, particularly oysters. Oysters are the most zinc-dense food on the planet. Zinc plays a direct role in testosterone synthesis, sperm quality, and androgen receptor activity. In zinc-deficient men, supplementation or dietary zinc has been shown to significantly increase testosterone. You don't need to eat oysters every day. Eating them two or three times a week should suffice. Moving into plant foods, cruciferous vegetables such as kale and broccoli deserve a mention. These foods contain compounds such as indole-3-carbonyl, which help reduce estrogen activity in the body. And lower estrogen relative to testosterone improves your hormonal environment and increases free testosterone. This isn't about boosting testosterone directly. It's about improving the overall ratio, which is just as important. Another solid addition is olive oil. Extra virgin olive oil has been shown in studies to increase testosterone levels and improve luteinizing hormone output. It also improves insulin sensitivity, which matters because insulin resistance is strongly linked to lower testosterone levels. Healthy fats don't just support hormone production, they improve how your entire endocrine system functions. So including extra virgin olive oil daily in your diet is an absolute must. Lastly are berries and dark fruits such as blueberries and red grapes. These are rich in antioxidants like resveratrol, which has been shown in studies to protect latex cells from oxidative damage. And less cellular damage means better long-term testosterone production, especially as you get older. 
Now one important thing to understand is that no single food will skyrocket your testosterone levels overnight. What actually works is stacking these foods consistently, eating enough calories, avoiding chronic deficits, and supporting recovery through sleep and training. Testosterone isn't just about lifting heavy and being aggressive. It's about giving your body the raw materials and environment it needs to function optimally. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and subscribe, and comment down below what topic do you want me to cover next. Until next time.